Hi, YouTube. Um, I had some great responses and personal messages sent to me um, from my last vlog, which was the Golden Swans Book Awards tag. And I'm super excited because I've been wanting to do some book reviews anyway, and now um, I have some inspiration because I've had some requests. Now, my goal is to do a um, vlog review on each book that I mentioned in that tag, but today I'm just going to start off with one of my favorite books from 2013, and that is Splintered by A.G. Howard. Um, now, Splintered, um, I'm on I'm on Goodreads, so if you're on Goodreads and you want to follow me, you can find me there. Um, but, uh, I'm going to read my review from Goodreads real quick because it's very short and then I'm going to add some things to it. Um, so on Goodreads, I wrote, wow, this is quite the writing debut, dark and yet bright, a perfect mesh of disturbing and lovely, gothic and ethereal twisted and blended into an eloquent journey. If you love Lewis Carroll and like Tim Burton or don't mind Tim Burton, um, then you will surely enjoy this. But even if you don't, and you just like to read something fresh and new, then this is for you. Not once did I feel like this story, bar story borrowed from another's work. It was engaging and thoroughly explored. I do hope that we have a continuation in the future. Now, when I said um, that it's, I didn't feel like it was borrowed from another's work, I genuinely mean that, even though it's based off of Lewis Carroll's novels. You go to Wonderland, but Wonderland is not the Wonderland from Lewis Carroll. It is this deeper, um, more mysterious, like darker um, journey that um, a young girl just has to go on. And and it, it did not feel at all like it was just, you know, Wonderland, but cha tweaked. It was Wonderland transformed. So um, it was pretty amazing to um, revisit Wonderland in this way. And the characters are strong. They're believable, enjoyable. They're lovely. They're um, they're authentic. Like you can feel the authentic human emotions. They don't react to something, and you're like, "What? Why would they react to it that way?" Like they they come across as someone that you could just talk to on just hang out with or whatever. And so um, I love that about it. The other thing I love is that there is a great portrayal of what the sacrifice of a mother is. And the sacrifice, the mother in this story, um, she's just, she's just what you would hope that every mother would, um, would be or do. And I'm not going to go into a great detail on that because I don't want to give away any spoilers. But um, you're going to think, what the heck is she talking about when you first start reading this book? But you'll see. Um, and then the other thing that I wanted to add is that I have not been reading a lot this summer on my own because I've been reading a lot with my kids. And so um, now that school started back up, I'm going to have more time to read. And I just realized, because I, like I said, I haven't been active um, in reading, I didn't realize that there is a um, novella now in this um, series, and the new book is um, going to be released very soon. So the new book, there it is a series, and there is a continuation. So I am so excited, and I really want to get my hands on these. Um, so hopefully, uh, I will be reading them as quickly as they come out and giving you a new review. So. Um, if you would like um, more information, you can get this book on Amazon, Barnes & Noble, anywhere books are sold. And I really, really do highly recommend it. I love this book. And, um, yeah, and, and, you know, even if you don't like Alice in Wonderland, if it's not for you, because I know Alice in Wonderland is more of a journey story that doesn't really have a huge point or plot and or whatever, um, I really think that you will really like this book because it is so unique in and it does have a point and a plan and a plot and a goal and a and you know there's there's reasons and stuff so I think that that this book is really good for quite a lot of readers so um anyway that was my that's my review um short sweet and to the point hopefully um hope you enjoyed please give me a thumbs up if you do or if you'd like to see more videos or um, book reviews comment below have a great day bye